Marquise Johnson. Johnson played in the league for 14 seasons with the Bucks, Clippers, and the Warriors. There are also two former male basketball coaches that are candidates for the 2022 Hall of Fame class. George Carl. He coached 27 seasons in the NBA with the Cavs, Warriors, Supersonics, Bucks, Nuggets, and Kings. Carl was named Coach of the Year in 2013 and coached in the All-Star Game in four different seasons. He led the Supersonics to the NBA Finals in 96, where they lost to Michael Jordan and the Chicago Bulls in just six games. The next male coach is Bob Huggins. Huggins has been coaching college for 45 years. He has coached at West Virginia for the last 15 seasons. He's made to the tournament 25 times and has uh, been the Final Four twice. Huggins was also the coach of Cincinnati for 16 years and then 18 Conference USA regular season championships and conference tournaments. He was also a three-time Conference USA Coach of the Year from 1998 until 2000. The West Virginia coach won the National Coach of the Year in 2002. This Hall of Fame class also includes a referee. Hugh Evans was a referee in the NBA for 28 years. He refereed 35 or refereed 35 NBA Final Games, four All-Star Games, and a total amount of 170 playoff games. Evans also refereed 1,900 regular season games. Now on to the female selections. The first is Lita Andrews. She coached high school in Texas for 51 years and had a record of 1,416 and 351. Andrews is the winningest high school coach of all time. In 2007, she was named as the National High School Coach of the Year. Andrews is in many Hall of Fames across the U.S. that includes the National Federation of State High School Hall of Fame, Women's Basketball Hall of Fame, Texas Sports Hall of Fame, and the High School Basketball Hall of Fame. Swin Cash is also a nominee for this year's Hall of Fame class. She was a four-time WNBA All-Star, a two-time Olympic gold medalist, and three-time WNBA champion. Cash was a two-time WNBA All-Star Game MVP in 2009 and 2011. She was an All-American at UConn in 2002 and was a national champion that same season when the Huskies went 39-0. Cash was also inducted into the Women's Basketball Hall of Fame recently. Another finalist is Lindsey Whalen. Whalen was a five-time WNBA All-Star, three-time WNBA champion, and won two gold medals in the Olympics in 2012 and 2016. Whalen was twice a nominee for the Naismith Award in 2003 and 2004. Marion Stanley is another candidate for this year's Hall of Fame class. Stanley is currently the head coach for the WNBA's Indiana Fever. She coached in college for 22 years with the Old Dominion, Penn, USC, Stanford, and California. Uh, Stanley went to three Final Fours and won back-to-back AIAW national titles in 1979 and 1980. The Fever coach won AIAW National Coach of the Year in 1979, Virginia Coach of the Year in 79 and 80, 81, 84, and 85, Sunbelt Conference Coach of the Year in 84 and 85, Pac-10 Conference Coach of the Year in 93, and WNBA Coach of the Year in 2002.